Now, President Uhuru Kenyatta has dismissed claims by critics of the Building Bridges Initiative that recommendations in its report do not warrant constitutional change, acknowledging that some areas in the report would be addressed through legislation. The President, however, stated that to achieve the desired long-term solutions, a constitutional review is a must. He spoke as he too had several development projects in Kisumu County. He was accompanied by opposition leader Raila Odinga, who said BBI would foster peaceful elections and tackle corruption. Achola Simon with the details. President Uhuru Kenyatta's tour of Nyanza on Thursday took him to Kisumu for a meeting with local religious and political leaders before inspecting development projects. Accompanied by opposition leader Raila Odinga, the president toured the 1.4 billion shillings reconstruction of the Mokenyata International Stadium and the Uhuru Market constructed to accommodate small-scale traders evicted to cater for revamping of the Kisumu port. But coming just a day after the release of the Building Bridges Initiative report, it is contents dominated the agenda with the president tailing off those opposing the report and its recommendation for constitutional amendments. The president said the report, once acted on by parliament, would provide mechanism for addressing issues affecting Kenyans. The president urged leaders across the country to support the document. For the very first time, the president would heap praise on the opposition chief for remaining steadfast in the handshake dream. Achola Simon, reporting for Channel 1 News from Kisum County.